Hello everyone. Welcome to the video, how to configure the TP-Link Powerline extender to your Wi-Fi network. This video is going to demonstrate how to configure the TP-Link Powerline extender to your home Wi-Fi network. You can do this in two different methods. One, copy your Wi-Fi settings from router to extender, or two, configure Wi-Fi settings manually. Both are fine. Let's go ahead and dive into both methods, shall we? First, copy Wi-Fi settings from router to extender. If your router supports WPS, it can automatically send Wi-Fi settings to your extender, allowing both to use the same SSID and password to transmit the same single network. The second method, configure Wi-Fi settings manually, is a little more involved, but it's all right. Uh, there's three different ways you can do this, via, via web browser, the TPPLC utility app, or the TPPLC app. Number one, via web browser. You can open your web browser and enter tppplc.net, that's TP. L I N K P. P L C dot net in the address bar to open the management interface. A D M I N. Once you're there, you'll see a wireless page and then go to settings. Here you can customize the wireless settings as you need. This includes changing the Wi-Fi name, SSID, and password. Save and you're done. Now you can connect to the new Wi-Fi network with the password you have just set. Moving on to method two via the TPPLC utility. Start by opening your web browser and go to our website, www.tplink.com. That's tp-link.com. Once you're there, enter the model number of your Powerline device in the search bar. Then click on the product and then its support page. On its support page, there are a few tabs. Find the utility tab. Once you're there, look for your version of the device and click the utility to download the zip file. Once downloaded, extract the file and open powerlineutility.msi. Follow the setup wizard to install the utility afterwards. Open TPPLC Utility. By default, it should be on your desktop as an icon. Once it's open, go ahead and move your mouse over to your Powerline extender and click the... Look for the wireless page and go there and click either 2.4 gigahertz or five gigahertz. These are separate signals, so um, they can have their own SSIDs and password settings. Here you can go ahead and enter a new SSID and password and click save. Uh, for the other band, you can do the same thing. Uh, a different SSID, a different password, whatever you wish. Now you can connect to the new Wi-Fi with a password you have just set. Third method, open the TPPLC app and you'll see all the TP-Link Powerline devices in your network. But if not, then drag the screen down to refresh. Select the extender and enter the management page where you can rename it and change its LED status. Enter the Wi-Fi settings page, select a band, and change the SSID and password. Connect to the new Wi-Fi network. 